Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I'd like to show you how you can add new fonts to LibreOffice Writer. So by default, you have a bunch of fonts which you can set your text to over here in the font name drop-down, like Adobe Gothic Standard Bold, for instance. But what happens if you went through all of these and you haven't been able to find one that you actually are interested in? Well, you can go online and find new fonts to install. For instance, uh, defont.com has a large selection of free fonts that are available to you, and you can download any of these and install them to your computer. So, for instance, let's say we like this lemon milk font. Uh, we like how it's laid out, we like how it's pretty clean and also bold, so I'll hit the download button. And you'll see that we get a zip file. We want to open that up with our program of choice. I like to use 7-zip. And you're going to be looking for a .otf file. In some cases, it might say something like .ttf. But you'll know it's a font file, uh, at least in Windows, because it'll be represented by the symbol over here on the left. Like with the little A, that's uh, basically the icon for font file. So we want to double-click that, open it up. And we'll get the uh, basically font browser type uh, pop up. And we can look through the font, see how it looks in each font size. And we can also hit the install button. And once we do that, it's going to install this font to our system. Uh, couldn't be any easier in Windows. So uh, now we can go ahead and look for that font. I believe it was called, yeah, Lemon Milk. Uh, so we have the font, and it's installed, and LibreOffice already knows it's there. So all we need to do now is to select some of our text and change the font. So one way is just to search through it by starting to type it in. Let's use the Lemon Milk font. And just like that, it's added in to LibreOffice Writer and all the other applications on our computer that would use fonts. Very simple, but also very handy. So I've been Chris. Thank you for watching. If this did help you out, feel free to check out my Patreon, and I'll see you in my future videos.